Hey, what's up guys? My name is Ilyas and welcome to the 10th jQuery tutorial. And in this tutorial, we are going to upgrade our chatbot. Well, we didn't really program the chatbot itself, but we built this interface using uh, HTML and CSS and we, we programmed some features using jQuery. And in this tutorial, we are going to uh, fix some issues which you already have. And the next thing I'm, I'm going to fix is, um, you know, after a while, after a while chatting, you get uh, the following effect that when uh, there is a lot of text and um, but the div element ha doesn't have any fixed height, you see that the div element gets um, gets bigger and kind of pushes the controls, just pushes the text box and pushes the send button and everything, and we don't have that. It's not cool. So, what do we want to have? We want to we want this div element to be uh, fixed, like to have a fixed height. And every time the text reaches this bottom, we want a scroll bar to appear right here, and we want to be able to scroll within this display. So, um, yeah, and we are going to do this uh, using jQuery as well. But um, in order to make this div element fix it, uh, we, we ha just have to add one line of CSS code. So just go ahead and check our CSS and find the container, which is, the container by the way is this display. And let's just say that it has to be a fixed height, so it's not m minimal height anymore. And just only add one line of code, which is overflow scroll. So what overflow scroll does is, well I'm just gonna show it to you. I chat a while, I have lots of messages right here and then you see that the div element doesn't get, doesn't get bigger so it just uh, get this scroll bar right here so it can scroll. But well it's that's not it because you see every time I normally user enters a message. Uh, you usually, well, every time you chat or on a chat room and you enter, you type a message and press enter. You would usually see your message right away. So the like the, the chat block platform scrolls down automatically to the very bottom, so that you can keep track of the of the newest messages. And in order to do that, we are going to use jQuery. So let's just go ahead and uh, try that. Right, uh, we want something to happen when the user clicks event. Uh, I mean, when the user users when the users click send the send button or just press the enter key. So this is the right place to write the following, to write the code for this for this bug for this for this to fix this uh, issue. And what I want to have, we want to uh, we want the script to scroll down auto automatically every time we enter a message. So let's just go ahead and select the container because this is the div element we are going to work with. And there is a jQuery build function called scroll top. And um, in the properties, we just um, we need to get the container's height, the, the container's current height. And that's why we need to select the container again. And then there is also a jQuery built-in function called prop, and it can it um, just fetches a property of something. And in this case, we have to get the property called um, scroll height. Well, it's kind of easy to memorize. Um, I'm calling the scroll top function on the container, and the scroll top function requires. Um, requires a number which is integer and this number is and in, in our case this number is just uh, the height of the of this element of this container so I think this co code should work so let's just go ahead and test it all right uh, and do not forget to reload the page every time you uh, make, make, make some changes in your document so let me just chat a lot, like just chat like a yeah. And you see that the sc scroll bar goes to the bottom automatically. 
without uh, doing anything and this is pretty much this is pretty much how the how the modern chat rooms work you see I see this message even though um, well even though it's all the way on the bottom because it scrolls down for me automatically so that's it for now for this tutorial and I hope you guys kind of learn new stuff we will we didn't really learn a lot in this video and the previous video as well but um, just I promise you if you guys watch this this video tutorial set uh, all the way to the end you'll learn a lot and you'll be able to build a, a cool website using jQuery and HTML and CSS and all the stuff so um, so that's it as I said and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial have a nice day